What's going on guys welcome back to another video and today's video we are going to be taking a look at closed beta 4 for our oneplus 5 now this beta was actually available as ota before but now it's been stopped yep you can't even download this full ota or the full rom throughout the official link yep it's not available so if you want to install this rom i will leave a link in the description and for the installation through the recovery roms are actually supported by the top recovery 3.2 so you have to actually update your top recovery and i know many of you guys want to actually install this rom as it doesn't require a factory reset in order to boot these roms just do a reset it would be helpful and also there are not much things changed over here in beta 4 no face unlock added over here if you want the face unlock you only have the option of closed beta 2 there is no face unlock in any of these betas also the battery life is just getting better and better in every single update now in this update the change lock was none because literally no one actually got the change lock those who have the auto updates enabled they got the update yeah there are not much of the things improved over here there are general fixes and as many of the users are reporting the low light capability of the camera has been improved and personally i have not checked it as much as other people but there is some kind of anti-green filter going on so the contrast would be bit dropped when you are actually doing a low light image photography and your image quality will be as same as the oneplus 5t so that's actually good also the video stabilization is not that improved for the 30 fps recording yep it's still crappy as there is no actual optical image stabilizer but if you are recording at 1080p 60 fps the image stabilization would be extremely good also so the close change lock says that there has been improvement for the fingerprint scanner so we are going to be checking that right now going to the security add a fingerprint scanner next we just set it as pattern let's just do done the ui has not been changed over here i guess they would be changing it as the face unlock accuracy seems to be just perfect as before the setup is much more easier earlier as i can remember you will get there was a miss point but earlier there were too many miss points but uh, they had been decreased right now so let's just try like literally it was fast now it's more faster yeah you can now just tap it also if you go to the settings as of the audio you don't get the new ui over here but you do get info for example in the device tab the info is already in but as you can see it shows your storage over here also the battery percentage and how much time is left to deplete the battery but if you now go to the personal now it actually shows when the apps are scanned also the location on and off scrolling down if you go to the advanced i actually forgot to tell you guys in beta 3 the bluetooth audio codec has been also available just as the oneplus 3 and 3t yep there was only the aptex and the aptex hd plugin available for the oneplus 3 and 3t but you also get sbc over here on our oneplus 5 but as i don't have any kind of bluetooth audio device i I can't actually confirm the actual quality that it's producing also if you go to the recent app management the deep clear has been a bit improved it just doesn't kill the apps it fully utilizes the 6 gb or the 8 gb as you have your device and that's pretty much it the build number is december 5 and you don't get the december patch over here it's still november 1 so that's pretty much it thanks for watching so in the next one peace